Hey there, welcome back to my channel or hello if you're new. My name is Raven and today we are doing another day in the life. This video was filmed directly after the one that went up earlier this week. So if you're interested in things being in timeline order or you notice like a few things following up from the last vlog, that's why. So getting started with the day, I got, I woke up on time, but I was very groggy. So I went back to bed and watched TikTok until like I had enough time to just eat breakfast and go to work. Um, I have been eating bagels and chai, which I realized fits the song from uh, the burgers and fries song from Bob's Burgers. So I've been singing that in the morning while I put my bagel in the toaster. get ready for work before I headed into my office. Normally, I like to at least be dressed and wearing pants, but uh, today I worked my first shift in my PJs, and uh, that also happened a few times this week where I get up, roll out of bed, go to work in my PJs, and then after that first shift, I go ahead, do, take a shower, make some coffee, and like halfway start the day. Uh, side note, do you guys want me to talk about what I do at work each day? Because a lot of it is same day to day, but I realize I don't really ever tell you what I'm doing. I felt like it would be too repetitive or boring, but I also talk about coffee and food every day and no one has told me to stop. So like I said, after work it was supplements, espresso, and shower. So I had forgotten to take my supplements before I ate. I'm supposed to take them before I eat because the probiotic says so on the bottle, but I would rather take it after I eat than just not take it at all because it does help my stomach a lot. So yeah, uh, I went ahead, got myself ready, and then started doing another little baby step tidy up in the kitchen. And then I just hung out with my husband when he got home from work because he worked the night before. salad from Marco's Pizza. I had gotten it the night before and it was a pretty good size. It's meant to serve too. So I had the second part for lunch and then I went in and settled into my office while a bunch of clouds went by. I just didn't feel like vlogging and being in the office. But when I got done with most of my work, Zach came in and he brought all of some packages that I had ordered. I started trying to order clothes off of Amazon because I don't really have clothes that fit or that I feel like express my personality. So we've got some items to go over. I only got three items. The first one was that floral dress. I got it in an extra large. I love it. It's very pretty. I think I could have gotten a large instead because it is very loose, but it's really pretty and I really like it. The colors make me so happy. I, the following two items are inspired by my childhood. I grew up in Southern California and these dresses just made me feel kind of nostalgic. I love that cactus dress. It is my favorite. I posted a picture of that paired with a cardigan on Instagram. If you didn't see it, I think it's really cute. I wanted like a tank toppy option for summer and it's really comfortable to go hiking in. And I did not like the avocado dress or skirt when I, when I first got it. The material 
isn't as nice as the other two dresses but I did wear it for a day to see if I would like it and I do actually really like it now that I've gotten to know it better. You know, first impressions, they're not always the most dress worthy. So after I had fun playing dress up, I also got some shorts by the way to wear under dresses, but after that I went ahead, had a frozen power bowl. We're doing a lot of frozen meals right now because our fridge is dead and we're living out of a mini fridge which has just gotten like it causes a lot of friction with like wanting to cook and executive dysfunction so it's not the end of the world but the workaround is just a lot of frozen meals and then I went ahead cleaned the area around my pole I also scrubbed the door like you saw because I wanted the points on sweepy and then I started working on pole, which is so exciting. Um, after the floor was less gross, obviously. Uh, I've been starting off my sessions with working on my core and inversion training. I used to be really comfortable inverting and being upside down, but I also never did them in a great form. I kicked into it and I always used inertia, inertia because I just, I didn't know better, so a lot of uh, YouTube videos have helped me to find a few things to practice to teach myself better form, so I'm trying to start my sessions with that so that I'm not super tired. Uh, towards the end, I do go ahead, kick into it so that I can practice being upside down. I used to be so comfortable, and now it's very disorienting, so I want to be strong enough to get up there on my own without kicking into it and also be comfortable so that I can actually work on doing some of the moves that I used to do that I really liked doing. Then, obviously, lots of spins. I have really been enjoying spins. I mostly retraining from memory while also using a few YouTube videos and just sort of playing around with it. I've even started playing with combos, which was never my thing, honestly, but now that I have it at home and I don't feel like I'm being watched, which is funny because I have a camera recording me, but now that I don't feel watched, I just feel like I have a lot more creative space and I also get to pick the music, which is always just a bonus. I think I'm getting to a point where I am looking for like online lessons or a digital instructor or something. I know that there are a lot of options. I haven't looked into a lot of them yet, but I'm getting to where I want to, which I think is really exciting and something that I will probably talk to you guys about when that time comes. Uh, yeah, I'm just really enjoying Pole, which real time Raven, editing Raven, I haven't done Pole in like two weeks because well, I feel like I'm PMSing a little bit and I just haven't wanted to and time is weird. But it'll, it'll, I'll probably get back to it. I'm also really excited looking at this. I'm probably gonna do it tonight even though I was scheduled to do yoga. I just blabbered on forever, but it was a really good session and a really good day, so I just had a lot to talk about. I had two full page notes of uh, for my voiceover typed up, so yeah. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you are new here and you want to see more, please hit subscribe. I upload on Wednesdays and Fridays and I would love to see your happy faces. Leave a boba or tea emoji in the comments if you're still listening and let me know how you're doing. I'll see you guys next week. Bye!